Hello, hello, and welcome back to Crusader Kings 3. We were trying just a little while before to pronounce French names. And yeah, I was telling out of Ron. This place is called Ron. It's very interesting. Uh, so I, I got down at Paris, Paris. And I had to go to my hotel, which was, I mean, to go to my hotel, I had to take a train that went to uh, St. Michel was the name of the stop. But then when I spoke to the person, he was French. So he told me that I had to go to Sam Shell, Sam Shell, Sam Shell. So I wrote it down as Sam Shell. S A M and because I was studying in Germany S C H E L L so I walked down to the to the metro to try and see how I can get there and uh, I was trying to tell the person that I wanted to go to Samshell and she just didn't know what I was talking about <laughs> so yeah it was uh, but you need to learn it you need to like learn the pronunciation if you're going to a particular country because it's it's really beautiful. I mean, French is a really beautiful language. So we have a bunch of stuff which we can do here. So after this event is over, we'll jump into that and we'll see what we can do about that. My mind set on a relaxing evening. I'm heading for my son, Brian's chambers with some spiced wine and pashisi board. Without knocking, I push the door open. Brian is seated by his desk, furiously writing. As I clear my throat, he jumps out of his skin. He quickly stuffs a roll of parchment into his pocket and turns towards me with an uneasy look on his face. So Brian is arrogant, generous and impatient. Is he impatient to take over control? Is Brian plotting against me? Are you Brian? Brian is seated by his desk. So let's see, what are you hiding? Show me at once. Which is something we might say because we are impatient too and we are wrathful. But we are not suspicious. Return later and search his chambers for the secret? No, we would definitely not do that because we're not that kind of person. Do we respect his privacy? Well, we might if we were not reckless, but we are reckless. So we are going to go with this. Did he really think I would not see that? Give it to me at once. Brian hands me the crumpled parchment, crosses his arm. Lists of food and drinks and many familiar names, including that of my favorite troubadour. It was supposed to be a surprise. I thought it would be a nice gesture to arrange a feast in your honor. Yet this is how you thank me? I'm sorry. I had no idea. I really didn't. I ruined this surprise. It's the worst when that happens, but I'm sorry, Brian. So Norway still occupies this part, Lincolnshire. But England has pretty much kicked Norway out in every other way. Okay, so if we bribe them, we can get a claim on Breifne, which we have right now. But let's quickly pause and let's jump into all of these things which are there. We have low county control in Connacht. We can remedy that real quick by getting our marshal to go there and increase county control. Uh, powerful vast, that's Domnal. I'm not even going to look at that. We can declare war, that's good. Uh, we can designate a guardian for Finn, which we do need. So let's get somebody who is really good at military. Seems like I'm the best at military. Followed by this courtier, who's gregarious, honest and wrathful. She's also a conscientious scribe. Huh. Right? You are going to be shadowing me. I am the best warrior here, my son. What else do you need except your father? So are we going to declare war on Breifna? They have no allies. We have four allies. Not that we need them. So we can definitely declare war for the title. And I guess we will be doing that. So we have declared war. Uh, let's raise our levies a little bit closer. So let's go into military 
and add a little rally point over here and let's click on that raise all over here 1670 troops it's not bad let's walk in here massacre the 960 that they have will they have an advantage because they're on the hills they might but that is not going to stop us oh we are reckless and they're reckless too so it's like this guy this guy could be my brother He's got like very similar traits to me. Alliances have expired. Alliances are invalid. Oosh. That's not so good. We could ransom Mayor Oingus. But we aren't going to. No, 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 no. We are going to take over Braifna. And once the northern and the western and the southern parts of Ireland are united, we will turn our focus to Dublin. Which, by the way, is... I, I, I read this interesting piece of tidbit that Dublin was named after uh, the black waters around Dublin. Fascinating. Right, so let's pause and let's enforce our demands because we have 100 war score. To the loathsome petty king Mochard, may your humors rot in your living body. Eesh. Nastiest way to start a letter. You are a much greater foe than I imagined. In order to put an end to this bloodshed, I will comply with your demands. Good. I have gained fame. So be it. Right, so our great kingdom of Munster spreads across the majority of the Irish Isles. Makes you wonder, what do we do after Ireland? Are we going to take over parts of Scotland? Should we look at Wales? Should we look at England? What should we do? Should we invade Norway? Pay them back for trying to poach the Isles from us? I don't know. But we shall see. Why is there a rally point here? Let's just get rid of it. So, I am... I think we have some people who are not happy with us. Uh, yes, definitely we do. So, let's try to sway this gentleman here. And uh, I am not going to release you from jail anytime soon. You fought against me. You could have just accepted that I was your king, but you didn't. You chose to fight me. And that must have repercussions. You must stay in jail for a little bit longer at least. My marshal has been hovering around my council meetings lately. Knowing his interest in matters of leadership, I cannot help but feel that the man is waiting for me to impress him. I could probably engage him in conversation. On the other hand, it might be better for him to simply see me interacting with my men. There is something to be said for at least pretending to know every soldier's face. Holding of Thaumann gets respected figurehead. Yeah, let's greet some recruits. Because I mean, I'm arrogant and all. I guess I'm arrogant, right? No, I'm just wrathful. But I'm still, you know, I still understand the importance of men who fight for me. I think the neighbors they're talking about are the neighbors across the sea. It's not these neighbors. It's not Ossery. It's not Dublin. Dublin. Dublin has nobody. Is it time for us to start fabricating on Dublin? It could just be. We can create the Kingdom of Ireland, the Duchy of Connacht. And Connacht and Breifna don't have enough control. But we're working on Breifna. Uh, we're working on Connacht. Once that's complete, I think we'll work on Breifna. So that should be fine. In the meanwhile, I think we have some time now. 
to go on a little pilgrimage so let's do that let's go on a pilgrimage to the holy land of jerusalem wait who is jerusalem under who controls jerusalem the fatimids byzantium controls beirut but jerusalem is not there jerusalem is here so i could go to jerusalem or i could go to the churches of the vatican i think that could be good let's go to the vatican it's time to depart i am so looking forward to creating oh what happened i lost some money because i'm going all right maybe it's time to get some money this way 30 30 gold i've gained the trait ill oops what happened it seems i've not taken well to all this travel perhaps it is strange lands filled with unfamiliar air or perhaps my furs are not warm enough either way my cough has been persistent for weeks this morning i could barely muster the strength to get out of bed do i even have the strength to continue onwards i'm not known to give up <coughs> that cough was thematic but i'm not known to give up so i shall push on i shall press on i shall go to the vatican and meet the pope if i die in the process my kingdom is in good hands i hope so for every week that passes my fellowship grows even smaller some have gone as far as they can before the need to return home overtakes them others have met a less fortunate end most worrying is the fact that my group of personal guards is thinning out at an alarming rate the fact alone shows what treacherous journey that can be some of the locals seem like they would be able to make fierce guards so i get foreign guards all i need is a protection of god i get divine protection yes let us trust the gods i think i would do that i mean i think much hard would do that cuz he's again he is not arrogant he's just wrathful as i woke this morning and saw rays of the sun falling through my window it took me a moment to realize i had slept soundly for the first time yes we have lost the trait ill that's good see the gods have smiled upon us i'm finally here body and soul at the great church of vaticano as the bishop offers me blessings i reflect on everything that had to happen for god to bring me here this moment in time walk the holy path so i gain the trait pilgrim and i am a determined pilgrim for 10 years that's good i'm a pilgrim now i don't know what advantages that gives me so it gives me plus 5 same faith opinion and monthly piety monthly piety of 10% which is good it's good to be home the pilgrimage ends yes i have come back with my faith restored did it wane for it to get restored i don't know I can ask the pope for money please do i need that and let me release you yes yes i'll use it wisely i will create a title for myself that will be how i wisely use it greetings my liege i accept the ransom good see now that's how you write a letter brefne what's what's his name it's the name of the dude Oh, I took over his title, right? So he's probably somewhere. But that's good. So I have three titles now, don't I? How many titles do I have? I have five titles. I have the Petty King of Munster, I have the Petty Kingdom of Ulster, Earlmund of Thomond, Earldom of Connacht, Earldom of Breifne, and I have one claim on the Kingdom of Ireland. but for that i think i need to create the title the kingdom of ireland which cost me 500 dollars 
फाइव हंड्रेड गोल्ड सॉरी नॉट डॉलर्स फाइव हंड्रेड गोल्ड बट इफ आई हैव दैट इन द बैग आई कुड क्रिएट द किंगडम विदाउट क्वेश्चन आई गेस ओके आई एम स्वेइंग दैट पर्टिक्युलर वैसल ऑफ माइंड विच इज गुड This is taking awfully long, isn't it? Yes, I accept. We shall fight. Ah, uh, where's my closest rally point? I guess it's this one. Should I create another rally point in Normand? I think I want to. I'm a kick your backside, man. Yeah, I'm gonna go and fight him face to face. I want to try and see if I can capture him, like get some prisoners, maybe some ransom. That could be good. It's unfortunate that claims in this game don't work. the same way that they work in EU4 because if that's the case then i could you know i could like in this war i could take some of his lands but doesn't seem like that's how it works so but we have a valuable hostage we've captured his son i guess there you go fighting him again he's just got like two stars against our big star or whatever it is He's a logistician. He's probably talking about logistics and stuff. He's building a new city, though. That's good. Sitting around the map table with Earl Domnall and Earl Mirtach, discussing a strategy for the ongoing war. Domnall eagerly points out all the prime targets we should immediately send raiding parties to pillage. While Mirdach sits back and patiently advocates for us to secure critical locations and wait for the enemy to come to us instead, what is right? What is the right thing to do? It is my right to decide our ultimate course. We can't. We don't want to do both. You are an idiot. Mirdach's plan is always better. But we could also say that my commanders can do as they please. I don't want to do that. Because Don Mal's an idiot. Somebody died. Tag. Oh my God. Why is this taking so long? We won the war. What? Are these some other people? Seems like it. Seems like it's not us. Seems like it's some other people. Oh man, Domnal is going to ask me for it again. Actually, looking at spy, this is five and this is four, so might as well give it to him. You know, at least get rid of that. One vassal. Wait. Ildak, Ildak, Ildak. You want something now, don't you? There was a commotion among the children today. Fine was attempting to preach among her fellow youngsters and became the target of a small fight. Finn intervened and managed to stop the fight before anyone got hurt. Remaining calm in the face of pressure is incredibly important. Finn keeps the trait calm. Yes, please. Be calm. Want you to be calm, Finn. Maybe we want to switch Domnal out. This dude has five. Domnal has four. It's just like a tiny little bit. I think I want to switch him out. Yeah, 
Yeah, no, Domnal. You need to die. Die and then I will give you some. Okay, so Connacht, we're getting a little bit of control here. So next is Brefna. Once we start working on Brefna, I will start fabricating a claim on Dublin. In the meanwhile, we can see if we reach 500. Oh, Chancellor. Uldach, where are you, Uldach? Reassigned to Chancellor position. I can't see you anywhere. Are you this same guy? Are you the spy master? You're bad at spy mastering. So, might as well do this, right? Keep everybody happy. No, you're not good enough. You're too young. This is 16. Olaf, you're very young, Olaf. You need to learn more. Rangwal died. Oh no. May as well, just to get rid of the message. Managed to avoid capture and has fled to the countryside. Traitor! I am angered. I am extremely angered by her behavior. And on that note, I want to put a quick cut in this video. Do like and subscribe if you like the content that I am putting out there. If you have any comments, please feel free to comment below. Until next time, take care now. Bye-bye then.